Alright, 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 alright. Hello everyone and welcome back, welcome back to Away, the story of our young sugar glider here at the end of the world where just as we found this amazing mother mushroom tree, a bioluminescent oak that was going to actually help us survive, we have now, oh this is so sad, how could we have lost our, our mother oak mushroom just as we met her, oh Look at this, she even had beautiful appetite shelf mushrooms on her. She was protecting us from the dangers that we were running into. Of wolves? Oh my goodness. I think her bioluminescent mushrooms are the ones we've had like a weird relationship with as a little sugar glider. Look, she's got these and she's on fire. She's gonna burn up, you guys. This is so sad. Just as we thought we found something that could really like help us have hope for the future. Oh my goodness. Oh. Oak trees. I have such a soft spot for oak trees too because they're so special to myself and my beloved husband Chips. Alright, can I make that? Oh, that's going to be really hard. Alright, I'm not going to question you, Mother Oak. Oh, Mother Oak tree. Oh, Mother Oak tree. Oh, Mother Oak tree. I would very much like to not be on fire, please. Okay, fire! No, my little Joey, I'm so sorry. All right, guys. Well, you know, that doesn't need to count towards the death count. This is just gonna be a little bit of a tricksy jump to make. Oh dear. Okay, look away, look away. <laughs> if you are of a sensitive nature and or prefer not watching our little Joey end up like plunging into its doom, I'm gonna try so hard to aim ourselves for this. Can there be an aim? Let's see. We're gonna find out. This poor little guy. This is this is the the stuff that like dramatic epics are made of. This is gonna be like our founder to some sort of special spore series. I am totally going to run. Good job, little one. <laughs> Trying to recreate our little sugar glider and his family so that they can live in peace. They're gonna have the most peaceful life as galactic emperors of all of the mushroom trees. I mean, of course I would love them if they, if, like, eat mushrooms. That's amazing. All right, hang in there, little one. Oh my goodness. All right, let's try to get down on this piece. Oh, okay. Next. Got it. Oh, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Yes. Ooh, okay. Almost got that. Almost got that. Hold on! Hold on, little friend! Oh my word. It would be very bad if you were a sugar glider afraid of heights, I think. Can we rescue our mom and sister? Surely the bearded vulture will have forgotten about his meal as his house like burns down, please. So that we can actually rescue mom and sis. All right, come on little hero. Come on. We've got this little guy. Okay, good, good, good. Oh, maybe we can like grab some sort of like mushroom riddled oak tree seed. of it to survive no no little one we were doing so well did you starve to death little friend oh my gosh okay so where are we supposed to go now i think i picked the wrong route oh over there jeez that was unforgiving you make one mistake of like uh where am i supposed to go next and and just the world kills you all right hang in there friend the glider must have worried the super heated bomb. you're doing okay you're doing now okay deadly to the touch oh Mom and sis! Oh, I have no idea, like, what kind of emotional bond the little sugar gliders have, but I'm telling you guys, he deserves to inherit the earth. This takes that game of the floor is lava to a whole new level. Alright, come on, friend. I wish you all of the safety from fire. I wish you all of the safety from cats left outside. This would be a very bad time for a house cat to show up. And they are very hard on sugar glider populations. No! 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 Okay, death count, it might be a little high. Might be a little high, but beggars can't be choosers. Okay. Alright. Oh, careful, careful. Oh, no, careful, little one. Oh, and there's nothing- I mean, there's not gonna be anything convenient to eat over here, I don't think. Not while we're just trying to, like, make it. Okay, okay. 
All right, come on. Oh, you're doing so good, little guy. The young glider is getting weak. Luckily, the forest floor should help him regain his strength. There's no forest floor up here. Don't you be cheeky with me. Hoping these morsels will help him to be back. Come on. Come on. Oh, he's dragging himself so far, trying to rescue his mom and his sister. Please. Oh, thank goodness. Okay. Okay. Oh, everything's getting, like, dark for him. He's running very low on strength. All right, come on. Come on, little friend. Oh, my gosh. Everything is, like, narrowing. Are you going to be okay? I can hardly see. Oh, boy. Okay, I think one misstep, and it would be the end for our little friend. And I can't, I literally can't see a thing at the moment as he's struggling. Like, where do we go next? Down there? We climbed up there. So, clearly, like, is this, is this where we're supposed to be? Or, oh, over there! Oh, once again, the mushrooms lead the way. Oh, and I can't, I can't lock onto this one. Oh my gosh, I can't believe we made that. All right, there we go. Oh, hang in there. Oh, he's really weak, you guys. Oh, I want to feed him. If I had a mushroom to offer him right now, I would just totally do it. Oh, come on. Why did this bird have to nest all the way at the very top of, like, Mother Mushroom Tree? Don't worry, Mother Mushroom Tree. When we finish away, I will celebrate by going ahead and rebuilding Mother Mushroom Tree and zoo crafting. Mom! Sis! Does mother and sister... They're still alive, but so is the vulture. Oh, what do, what do we do? Am I gonna have to fight him? Guys, I don't think this is gonna end well, but we're gonna follow our little hero forward. We're gonna do our best. Ah! Ah! Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, no! Okay, that was clearly just a dream, a vision of what could happen if we're not cautious with this battle. Because of course, with his fur singed and exhausted, see, we had a little nap. Now we're feeling a little bit better as we're figuring out what we need to do. Okay. Apparently we're getting on the back of the vulture. Apparently we're attacking him. Are you kidding me? Okay. Okay. No, he got us. Dang it. But it seemed like we had him for just a second. This is going to be probably as like glitchy twitchy of a mess of a possible rescue as we could think of, but I have no fear anymore. All right. Oh, and we're ripping into him, we're ripping into him! Tear his feathers out! Make him, make him regret the day he decided to do this. Alright, rip those feathers! Get that bird! You can do it, little friend! Alright. You can do it, little friend! We've got this! We've got this! No! He threw us down! What happens now? Mom! Is this where we lose mom? No, mom's helping. We've got to help mom. We're taking them down together. It's like two tiny itty bitty little kids taking down a dragon together. What the heck? Mom! Oh, she's going to die saving our lives. I just know it. This is the tragic hero arc. I feel it coming. I see all the flags. Alright, alright, alright. Oh, don't leave, Mom! Don't leave, Mom! We're almost dead! I know we need to survive what's coming! I'm doing my best! Come on! We've got this, Mom! Attack him! But what about Sis? Oh, now we're on a, like, wild ride! Are you kidding me? <laughs> This is one of the greatest epic stories I've ever seen. These poor sugar gliders. Oh my gosh. But what about little sis? The tree is burning. 
We're tearing into him! Alright, come on! Come on! Come on! Mom! Mom! Mom, jump! Mom! <gasps> Mom! And so the mighty bearded vulture falls into the flame. I knew it! And with it, our journey. I knew it! Oh, that's so sad. Our little Joey. We gotta go get little sis. Sis! The glider's sister still lives. If the Joey moves quickly, he may yet be able to rescue her. Come on. Little sis, okay. She's on our back, friends. We've got her. We're not gonna let mom's sacrifice go in vain. And dad sacrifice. Jeez. What do you mean glide now? I don't have any energy. Where are we going? To towards the light. To the light. To the light, I guess. Oh. Oh, my word. No sis, no sis, no sis. We've come so far, no sis. She's so small. He jumped off after her. What? We've lost so much. Where is she? Where is she? How will such a small creature struggle- Oh, sis! How will such a small, small creature struggling against Peace the end of the world? To Savior Island. The Joey and his sister rest and recover on the shore to the rhythmic sounds of the waves. Though the glider has suffered a great tragedy in the loss of his mother, he has gained strength and resolve beyond his years. Having surmounted innumerable hardships against all the odds, our Joey must once again muster his courage and face whatever challenges the island has in store. His sister is relying on him after all, and he will not let her down. Oh, As this remarkable my gosh. animal gazes out towards the horizon, the rising sun offers hope for a new nest, a new home, and a new dawn for us all. What the heck? Oh my gosh, you guys! That's the end! What the heck? Sis! Uh, sis, we got some, some mushrooms over here. You want to come eat some food? Are these a different type of mushroom? Well, I hope that the... Oh, they are! I hope that the oak tree maybe was able to send out some spores or something. And we'll be able to, like, continue to, like, take good care of Sis. I'm so worried about her. But I guess all we can do is just like live from one moment to the next. Jeez. You know, this really makes me think how hard it would have been. Just, oh, hello, sis. So now sis is actually like traveling with us and we're exploring with her. It makes me think about how difficult and how hard it would have been to actually just survive from moment to moment across the centuries and the millennia until you end up becoming there we go. We'll eat some of that. Okay, sis. Oh, sis jumped off. Is she eating it? Sis, you be you be careful now. I don't want to lose you. But it would have been hard to just like exist and travel from moment to moment to moment in order to go ahead and evolve over the millennia into where we are today. It's why I respect even the little small creatures. Like people might not think much of like a mouse and not think much about like letting their cats outside to eat the mice and stuff like that, but Come on, like, its ancestors had to be some of the lucky few who, through their their own luck and instincts and ingenuity honed over millennia of evolution, made it to this point. That was really nice. You guys, 
We still live on an arachnid filled island at the end of the world and in an apocalypse. We still have so many unanswered questions from like, why is the narrator actually aware of us? How are researchers watching us? What it is, well, like, what is it about the sugar gliders in particular that they're really curious about? And what can we do now? Will we be able to explore? Will we be able to just like set ourselves free across the island and maybe find even more of the secrets waiting for us? We no longer have mom. We have our little sister to take care of and protect. We have this whole island that we might need to dig through. But I guess now it's just up to us to be like a good example of sugar glider life and survival and teach our sister how to, how to make it. Huh. So all right guys, thank you so much for joining me on this adventure. It was definitely far more wild than I was expecting. Holy cow, it took very, 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 very unexpected turns. But I think, oh, nope, yep, still on the spider infested island, what did I say? But I don't think it's quite over just yet. I think there's still quite a bit more to explore. So I'm gonna poke around a little bit and we might pop about in exploration mode, teach our sister how to fight spiders and begin our sugar glider legacy that I hope will take us through the ages. And I, now I'm so tempted to go ahead and try to make them somehow in Spore, I truly am. If you guys like that idea, let me know, get down in the comments. But most of all, my friends, I hope all of you stay curious and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.